Hi friends, it's our second day in Nashville and my girls are all ready to go. Sama is so eager. She has been waiting and waiting. Go. You're ready to go. Yes, you are. Me too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. First, we are going to check out the rooftop lounge in our hotel. You can hear the music coming from it and the girls are dancing. So excited. Go, go in. Go and look for daddy. This is the view from the rooftop of the hotel. going out to check out different places today which is our second day in Nashville I'm actually just staying here we went and we saw had an amazing view of the city from the rooftop of our hotel now we are going to have some drinks the hotel has an amazing cafe I'm going to I ordered an ube latte drink they say it's visually proper and it's based on ube which is I think it's a sashi vegetable almost like taro or cocoyams or potatoes so i'm eager to see what that looks like yeah the cafe is actually quite nice everything here is just so cool i love the decor everything is so cool and inviting oh my god and we're having a great time i think we are just going to take today which is a sunday to rest a little and plan i have a list of um, the places we want to visit then we are going to to head on to those places from tomorrow Bye -bye. do we know you Yeah, you're very welcome. Enjoy. That's, that's your chai tea. Chai iced tea. Then this sweet tea is for me. I want to try my sweet tea. This one has a good No, this one is for you. I want to. Yes. I want to. I want to. That's for you guys. That color is so pretty. Look at that, and it's like ombre. It goes like. Wow. As you go down, you get the rich, the rich flavor of the ubi. It's like a kind of potato, like a sweet potato. Wow. That's iced tea, sweet tea. Let's see. Mommy, but who owns is that? It's still mine. Mm. Yeah, I'm looking for green tea. It's nice. It's actually really good without the sugar. It's good, right? It's our third day in Nashville and we are having breakfast at our hotel. I love, love, love the hotel's breakfast and let me show you guys what it looks like. So, so good. There is a waffle stand here with the waffle makers, whipped cream, the butter has already been mixed and the butter just comes out of this machine and more waffle makers and then um, toppings, peanut butter, syrup, um, jam, jelly, and then there's a toaster here and right here there's um, bagels, um, bread, regular white bread, wheat bread, um, muffins, blueberry muffins, um, I don't know what the other flavors are, they look like some kind of nut muffins, um, toaster for toasting the bread, um, fillings for the bread, I love that there's grass fed butter, and then there's cream cheese, regular and um, low fat cream cheese. And then there's um, Nutella and um, breakfast syrups, jam, jelly, like we saw before. And then there's also honey, pure honey. Mm -hmm. There are some sausages here. 
and my favorite thing here ever are these eggs these eggs are so fluffy this omelette is so so good and then some cheese and some eggs toppings for oatmeal and in here there's oatmeal cutlery cereal for the kids my little one had cereal um some yogurt orange juice and milk Water. right here we have orange juice apple juice um, more orange juice and i love this passion fruit orange and guava it's so tropical and then there are some oranges then the coffee and tea bar i had black tea yesterday i'll probably have black tea again today um some toppings and then some coffee so this is what I am having, some waffles and I have my black tea in here. For lunch, I ordered Hattie B's chicken, which is highly recommended from all the research I did before coming here, you know, I kept seeing Hattie B's. It's a restaurant that serves Nashville hot chicken, which is a popular, popular food in Nashville. You definitely have to try Nashville hot chicken if you come to Nashville. In fact, my other girl was like, the other day, um, my daughter Salma was like, we've been in Nashville for two days and we haven't had hot chicken. <laughs> it's like we've committed a scene. Anyway, it's day three and finally we are getting the Nashville hot chicken. So this is my order from Hattie Bee's. We are at the Musicians Hall of Fame and Museum. I'm so excited to check it out. hi friends okay that chicken yesterday i didn't tell you guys about that chicken the chicken was good but it was not as phenomenal as i hoped it would be because the long lines i saw waiting to get into those restaurants i thought there was something about their chicken that was going to completely blow me away it was tasty um i got the mild it was nice and mild mildly spicy i got one for the kids that didn't have any um spice in it it was good you know I really don't know why it's that popular but it's worth checking it out for yourself so it's day four is it day four yeah it's day four in Nashville today we just had breakfast at our hotel we stayed there we had some food to eat for lunch but it's evening and we are going to the Nashville farmers market I'm going to see if I can get some food um, for dinner I also just want to go around and see the different vendors there I love farmers markets that it's just one of my favorite places to be a farmer's market so i'm going to bring you guys along with us so i'm at the grocery store right here in the nashville farmer's market and to my surprise they have african food let me show you guys look Eru, crayfish, egusi, sardines, you guys. They even have the different kinds of fufu, plantain fufu. It's day five in Nashville 
Today we are taking a tour of the city, finally. Today we are finally taking a tour of the city. We came late for our bus. We literally saw the bus when we were the, on the other side of the road and I felt like saying, wait, wait, we're coming, but it was too late. So the bus took off, we are just waiting. Um, the bus comes every 30 minutes to pick us up. It's called the, the bus we are using is from the company called Old Trolley Tours and they are going to give us a tour of the city. I'm so excited. It's an easy way to see a lot of key places in Nashville in one day rather than trying to drive around and see it yourself. So come along with us. It's rolling hills, a lot of rock, granite, and limestone. That's where Nashville's located. To the left-hand side, you'd pop out there and you'll see this four-foot granite wall to your left. We call it the pathway to history. There are stories, facts, and quotes etched into this wall starting on June 1, 1996, the day this park opened up. And it goes backwards chronologically for 200 years. These between stage sets. Willie said it was 17 steps to the bar and 34 back to the stage. Hi friends, it's our seventh day in Nashville. I cannot believe we've been here for seven days. We came here on Saturday last week and today is Friday. It's been so long <laughs> and rewarding. I don't think we've been away from home for this long so that's really nice to get away for a while and there's so much to see in Nashville. I feel like if I'm here even in a month I might not fully exhaust all that there is to see. It's just so much which is beautiful. There's so much to take in. I ordered Biscuit Love yesterday. Um, Biscuit Love is a popular restaurant here in Nashville. When we're doing research about Nashville, Biscuit Love kept coming up as a restaurant to try. I love biscuits. I have a couple of biscuit recipes on my blog right now. I have about three or four and I have one biscuit recipe I'm working on right now. It's going to be on the blog as soon as I'm done testing the recipe. So I had to order biscuit love. They have this thing called a bonut. Bonut is basically what we call in Cameroon, my country of origin, we call it gâteau. It's some kind of donut um, which is like thick, heavy. It's like puff puff but it's heavier. So this restaurant, their bonut is biscuits combined with donut. So they take their biscuit dough and the fry as a donut. It comes out basically like our Cameroonian gâteau. If you if you are from Cameroon, there's this gâteau they used to call misge or na amisge or misge gâteau. It's just like it, even to the point of part of the gâteau drinking some of the oil. But my favorite thing from Biscuit Love was their grits. Their grits were phenomenal. I'm going back there for the grits. The grits were just, <sighs> I don't even know. Like I just, I could imagine myself holding that for breakfast in the morning and just feeling so fulfilled and ready to take on my day. They were that good. These are our donuts. We also had like we also had strawberry donuts, but <laughs> we already ate it, so this is what's left. <laughs> okay, we're going to try the other ones. So we just left the five daughters bakery. Their donuts were good. I love the flavors. Um, I really loved the strawberry one. Um, my daughter Salma says she loved the strawberry one best as well. Um, oh, Naria. It was Neria, 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 sorry. <laughs> Neria loved the strawberry one best as well. Um, Yoyo loved the strawberry one best as well. Sama loved the vanilla cream one. They were all good. The vanilla cream donut is their most popular donut because I asked them. It has a filling, a custard like filling in the middle, then it has the cream on top. It's really nice. So um, we are going to go through the Broadway Street. Or I think they just call it Broadway, not Broadway Street. We are going to go on Broadway right now. 
that is like the happiest street I've ever <laughs> driven through people are just in good spirits and I love to see it so we're going to go through it now The same group of girls inside. I said. Who are totally <laughs> different people. Yeah. The buildings here are the architecture yeah, is something else. Historic. As you guys see <laughs> rooftop bars here are so common. So rooftop it's bar, you have a building that rooftop, the rooftop restaurant. can be used. It is crazy. You automatically have a business. This is a music work of fame, just like you have the work of fame for movies in Hollywood in California. This is a music work of fame for famous musicians that made the industry and it's right here in Nashville in Tennessee. the restaurant on the rooftop of our hotel and we're going to have dinner here tonight i come up here some days earlier and i've seen the beautiful view up here the view of the city is so beautiful so we are going to just eat their food see what it looks like we ordered some mocktails and for the girls we ordered some lemonade as our drinks so we are just waiting for the food now last day in Nashville we are all packed and we are going to check out of the hotel our flight is in the evening so we have a few hours to explore Nashville one last time before we go so yeah are you guys sad that we are going home or you're happy how how happy how sad how happy that's how I feel too like I want to you want to go on the air you want to go on the airplane you want to go back home? Yeah. Okay. Essie, do you want to go back home? No. Uh, Essie, you who has been missing home all week. You want to go back home, Mama? No. Oh, okay. Yes. You promise me? Okay. See you. Oh, whoo! Yes! This is the Parthenon right behind me. This is a replica of the Parthenon that is found in Greece. 